Some things in life do not seem fair, like how some people seem to get more bug bites than others. This week is actually the peak of mosquito season in the Twin Cities. That got us wondering, why are some people more prone to mosquito bites? Susan Elizabeth Littlefield sniffed out the unusual answer to tonight's good question. Amidst the beauty and fun of this Minnesota summer, there's an unwelcomed experience unfolding too. Do you get a lot of mosquito bites? Yes. yes. Yeah. What does it feel like? It itches a lot. It hurts a lot. So when they bite. But for others, mosquitoes, which suck human blood to help develop their eggs, are nothing more than an unseen nuisance. Now, some people say they get eaten up. Where do you fall on that? Probably on a scale of one to five, probably one. <laughs> like, barely, barely. Like, my mom and I, like, garden a lot in our backyard, and, like, I'll see her come with, like, tons of mosquito bites and I'm here like oh I have nothing like I'm sorry like I don't know help you. <laughs> so why are some people more prone to mosquito bites? Well as it turns out the answer kind of stinks. One thing that scientists have known for a long time is that mosquitoes are attracted to the odor of um, used gym socks. The U of M mosquito expert gave us the unexpected explanation. They're being attracted to that kind of mix of bacteria and fungus that causes foot odor. And so um, that's why mosquitoes often bite people on their feet and ankles, as probably many people have noticed. Dr. Oliver explained that mosquitoes can also be drawn to people for genetic reasons. Some people metabolize food in a certain way and emit a certain smell. So it may not be that you're unclean. It might be your particular odor attracts the bugs? Absolutely. So if you had two perfectly clean people next to each other who just had the same, you know, bathing regimen, uh, one of them could definitely still be bitten more than the other. So it's not in our heads. Some of us are more prone. Yeah, it's absolutely the case. Ironically. I got one. Oh, you did. <laughs> Susan Elizabeth Littlefield. And it was on your ankle. Yes. <laughs> WCCO for news. Huh. Uh, Dr. Oliver says there are ways everyone can make themselves less desirable to mosquitoes. He says that there are rumors that things like drinking lemon water helps, but he says that the repellent with DEET is the best way to avoid bites and use scent-free shampoos, soaps, and lotions.